Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and how are you today? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, here's the daily crop to help you along your way. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of day it is, it's for you. Yes, it's always the morning for me. A couple of times I think I did an afternoon one, but it's usually morning. I mean, another bright, sunny day. I have been out getting my tan on, and I do have a workshop going on this morning. I'm attending a workshop. I'm not the facilitating one. Not yet, but I would love to do that here. I might begin within home. That's all... Part of the bigger plan of things for my begin within gifts, books, and healing services, right? Right! Uh -huh. Don't you know? Anyway, let's go. Ah, welcome to the Daily Crumb with me, Wingy Schneebay, Mujaki Kwe, your friendly, freaky ass, sweet grass, wild, and medicine woman, also Christiana Carr, Chris Carr, superstar, all this beautiful divine being right here. Welcome, are you beautiful divine beings right here, too? How goes it with you? Yo! All right, okay, okay, now, you know, I've been forgetting. I, f I think I forgot once. Outside thing. I'll be doing more outside, too. Love it out there. Or in my sunroom. I have to shift, shift things up, you know? You can change it up every once in a while. Get a new perspective. Once you embrace your value, talents, and strengths, it neutralizes when others think less. Once you embrace your value, talents, and strengths, it neutralizes when others think less of you. It's by Rob Leano. As you fall asleep, reflect upon your strengths, value, and talents. Okay, I said that all wrong. <laughs> Still all the right words in the wrong order. As you fell <laughs> as you fell asleep. Oh my goodness. Okay, let go. Let's get through this. We're doing it together. We're getting through this together. Thank you. Thank thanks for those extra vibes. Thank you. As you fall asleep, reflect upon your value, talents, and strengths. Okay? <laughs> Any time, take a point right now. Take a moment, reflect upon your values, talents, and strengths. What is that? Do you appreciate it because you see that? Are you told that that's what? Mm, something that came into my head. The parts of you that you like, you like them because you like them, or because somebody else liked them. Mm. I don't know. I don't know what's that for you? Okay, what's the total? What's the path and the totem helping us to reflect on this, to look and embrace our work? There's a path. <sighs> totem. The path went sideways. It told him in it. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, need another one. It's the void. No, that's not a... There we go. Okay. Oh, and we do. We have the Moon Lodge Retreat. Well, that's my moon time. is coming. Slow time is coming soon. Retreat. Take the time. Retreat. Reflect. That's the Moon Lodge. And then on top, we have the deer. We're being gentle with ourselves and healing, right? Deer popped out yesterday, too, didn't it? Even if we can remember, we won't be gentle. We need to retreat sometimes to heal. You need to retreat and look within. Take that time and here we go. West Shield for introspection. We're reflecting on our talents and abilities. Well, yeah. So we need to take the time to reflect on that. Take some introspection. And our goals. What are our goals based on that, right? Do our goals line up with our talents and strengths? Right? 
Ooh, I don't know. Like, I want to be a carpenter, but I'm a better mechanic. I don't know. I have talents working with small engine repair. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> See, my, but I can't even get the word straight, so maybe you can think of your own example. But that's when, when we tap in and do that introspection, when we reflect on we, that, that void, the unlimited potential. That's what the void is. They say, like, like the great mystery lives in the void or the great spirit is part of the all, whatever. All that is, was, never will be, always will be. <laughs> ah, there we go, that's the void. The message from the void, you're about to meet your potential destiny. It's, it's an unlimited power, a potential miracle, and the key to unlocking your creative abilities. The key to unlocking your creative abilities is to reflect on them, to look at that. What is the talents that you have? And the one helping us with that is owl deception. Do you think that you have no talent? Do you think, eh, you know, or there's so many others doing it. Remember, it don't have your flavor. You know, there's many authors. There's many musicians and singers and writers and all kinds of artists and carpenters and all that but it doesn't have your flavor right so don't deceive yourself that oh the world's got enough of that it doesn't need i ain't got nothing to offer when you do so take that look inside reflect on your talents and abilities and you know your work because you're very very worldly value talents and strengths yeah it's their value very worthy. Okay, 10 and 21. The void doesn't have a number on it. That one says a 52. <laughs> Okie dokie. So there we go. Reflect on those talents and strengths. Who are you? What are your goals? Do they line up with your talents and strengths? Are you doing it because that's what you want to do? Or are you doing it because that's what you were told? Do you think that's a talent because uh, you, you, you worked at it? Whatever, now I'm just rambling as I'm putting these up there. Ow, oh, it doesn't hurt. <laughs> Big as heart hugs ever. Yes, thank you for being you. Shining your light through everything that you do because you know what this world needs you to be you. Fully, holy, and true. Thank you for being you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for choosing to stay. Let's celebrate another beautiful day. Thank you. Have a wonderful, blessed day. Love you.